Welcome back. Local group of Christians aims to break down barriers right here in the Rockford area. And one way of doing it is through a pay this Saturday and joining us this morning is Jess Hansen and Diana Walker. Good morning, guys. Good morning. How are you doing? Thank you so much for joining us Thank this you. morning. Why don't you tell us a little bit of the background of the Rockford Christian Unity Group? Well, I'll tell you what happened. About two years ago, we had a, a meeting on the bridge that's on State Street. The West State Street churches and the, and the East State Street came together and said, we need to start doing something to break down barriers. We've been separate for so long. We're trying to get all the ethnic groups to work together because we're all the body of Christ. And so he said, well, let's do a picnic. You know, because we all like food, right? Mm -hmm. And so we met, we made a Camp Winnebago, which is run by the YMCA out on North Main. And now we've, the first year was 50, it was kind of rainy, second year was 800. So we're hoping to at least match that this year. And uh, Diana's done a great job of helping to organize and get all the food together and all the activities together. So we're trying to really uh, get the different churches in Rockford to come together. And everybody is invited to come to this event. And it's totally free, right? Yes, it is, it is totally free. That's an added bonus. Why don't you tell us, Diana, then a little bit about some of the fun things that are going to be going out on the picnic on um, For the older group, we'll have bingo, and it'll be inside of an air-conditioned room. Okay. And for the children and uh, the parents, we have all kinds of activities, whether you want to climb a, a wall, whether you want to do archery, uh, kickball, a bouncy house. The police department will be there with their mobile vans, nice. the audio and the, the arts van. And so uh, the mayor will be there to kick it off and just lead us to the opening ceremony and just a lot of fun things, fun activities. And actually our goal is to break down barriers and get people to develop relationships. So do you see people develop relationships then when they come out to the meeting I mean, or the event? I mean, what's their reaction when they go there? Yes, it is. Um, my, last year was my first year involved in it. And after that, people were saying, this is such a great idea. I met people that I didn't know from different faiths and things. And they've established relationships yeah. that are ongoing. Yeah. I think it was kind of interesting that you mentioned that from the east side of the river and the west side of the mm -hmm. river, it always seems like there's this divide between east and west Rockford. So... What do you think about then bridging that gap, especially between churches? Because you don't generally think, oh, yeah, the churches are divided because, like you said, everybody's Christian, right? Well, we're just, we're just trying to realize that when you get to know somebody, you start trusting them, right? When you don't know somebody, you're not with them, you don't trust them. And so we have to be together in order to build bridges and, and to start trusting each other. And that's not starting to work now in Rock, I believe. And the collaboration with the YMCA is great because it really undergirds our mission which is un unification because people only know the why is the why but actually it was originally a fellowship for new men coming into the community and having them develop relationships so that collaboration with the why is great we're hosting it at camp winnebago and we're just happy to have them as a sponsor all right diana and jeff thank you, thank so, you much. so much once again that picnic going on this coming saturday